is up guys welcome back to the channel Super Bowl is here against the, with the Atlanta Falcons taking on the Kansas City Chiefs here the Chiefs finished the season 10 and 6 uh, was edged out by Denver uh, in the division race but none of that matters now because they they was able to uh, sift their way through the play playoffs and uh, find themselves in the Super Bowl here. So Atlanta Falcons, Kansas City Chiefs, a matchup that a lot of people may not have uh, thought about. And uh, I went ahead and put the, uh, we'll put him, put Emil Harry in here, he's on excellent. He's got 63 receptions, so he's the best option for him. Uh, for the uh, instead of uh, instead of good old Alfredo Roberts and uh, JJ Burden's on bad, so that's yeah. See JJ's on bad, so we're gonna uh, give them the best best lineup there for them, and got some good plays for them. Koi's on good, so yeah, we got our work cut out for us here. Super Bowl, baby. Let's have a good game. Super Bowl underway. <coughs> of course, we, we opened the season against the Chiefs. So who would ever thought <laughs> we'd be uh, meeting again in the Super Bowl, right? For let's uh, hope hope uh, this game has the same outcome as that first game, but I got a feeling it won't be won't be a blowout. Well, I, but I don't know. We'll see. Let's have a great game. <laughs> Field. Steve DeBerg completes his first pass to Rob Thomas. Chiefs are threatening early. First to go for the five. What? Shit! Oh, I whipped around him. I was out of control. <laughs> oh god, my hair. Oh boy, that's my fault. <coughs> I guess, to my defense, I am I'm feeling under the weather a little bit, so... No. <laughs> Take that into consideration. Tracy Johnson with a good return! Nice! The special teams for both teams are on full display today. Touchdown, too. That was a freaking touchdown. Sean Collins is there wide open. 
Oh boy. Third and seven here. Can we get a stop? Ready, down. Put, 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 put. Jesse Tuggle makes the tackle. Brings on the punting unit. Sean Collins with a big catch. Nice. End of the first quarter. Chiefs lead seven to three. Falcons look, looking to put more on the board. Miller found Andre Rising. Yeah! <laughs> and the Falcons take the lead. First down, looked like he was over across the line. Lucky for us, they don't have challenges back then. <laughs> I think that would have been ruled a touchdown. Ready, down. Put, 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 put. Ready, down. Put, 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 put. Ooh, I think he, would, he looked across too. Third and goal from the one. Like I said, I think that was a touchdown anyway. Koya, Koya looked like he had the ball across the goal line. So. Oh, we got a long way to go down on the 10-yard line. 
at the end of regulation to tie the game. <coughs> and then caught, then caught the winning touchdown in overtime. So yeah, he got a huge game last week. Right, look at that. Six seconds before half. Talk about in the clutch, right? Performing under pressure when it matters most. 17-14. to 14. Pretty good first half, I guess I'd say overall. So now's the, now's the time to get some refreshments, you know, maybe grab a snack. Sex to stay and get you a hot dog and some nachos, you know? Live it up. Chiefs are going to punt. In the end zone, they'll get it back at the 20. Oh, Mike Rozier breaks the tackle, makes a big play. They can't get him. Finally, do the five. Ready, down, wow, that was an impressive running there by Mike Rozier. Now the Falcons go up 31 to 14. Can the Chiefs make a comeback?
Steve DeBerg with a scramble for the first down. He's throwing for Stefan Page. No dice. Deion Sanders breaks up the pass. Ooh, Rob Thomas makes a big catch for the first down. Should have been a touchdown, but couldn't come up with it. With a five, the Chiefs bring on Nick Lowry. Oh, it's blocked! Chiefs recover it, but it's over. The play's over. Under pressure, over <coughs> found Michael Haynes, who was running a post pattern. Done his part today. He's got the Chiefs a good, good return yardage. Did the did the <coughs> when the Falcons got that touchdown right before half? Did, did it's almost like that took the wind out of the Chiefs' sail because you know it was that made it 17 to 14 at half. But since then, it's been all Falcons. Deion Sanders on a quarterback blitz. Sacks DeBerg. Turnover on downs. One more play, and that should do it. It's over, 38 to 14 is the final. Chris Miller, a huge day, 80% completed for 310 yards. Mike Rozier, also a big day, eight rushes, 111 yards. 
Andre Rice and three catches, 141 yards. <laughs> well, history, in this case, history repeated itself, right? But man, what a difference, uh, you know, from the first half to the second half. Well, Chiefs, Chiefs took the lead 14 to 10. It was back and forth there that first half. But we did get that touchdown right before half. And I don't know, that must have swung the momentum. That must have been that must have been defeating to the that, that must have been crushing to the Chiefs because they was really hoping to hold us out. Because then we came we got the second half kickoff. We went down and got a touchdown there and kind of was you know, he's off to the races, basically, right? Yeah, I think Chris Miller just had that one incomplete pass at, at the, on that first drive where we had to settle for three, right? But yeah, heck of a day on him. Other than that, he made, he made some nice throws today. I think he did have a... Yeah, he had another incomplete because he went to, for Rice and in the end zone on that first drive when he incomplete. So I think he had a couple of completes, but still, 80%, 310 yards. Heck of a day. And the Atlanta Falcons are Super Bowl champs. Their first ever. Chris Miller, he made some of the throws, he made some throws under pressure, you know, and they, it's like they were on target, I was, I was impressed, I was impressed with him today, he came, he came to play, Rozier, he had a, well heck that one drive, it was all Rozier, he had two runs, you know, one was that big run, got us down to the five, and gave it to him one more time, he got it in there. Pretty good, pretty fun game, it, like I said, it was, it was competitive in that first half, but, you know, took over that so we just dominated that second half. That's all I can say. Yeah, pretty good season with the Falcons. I like the you know they're not a great team on here. They're, I'd say they're um, a so-so team. They're they're an average team. But I kinda like taking the average teams, you know. I like I like the underdog. I'm always rooting for the underdog, right? Usually. <laughs> thoughts in the comments below on this game what a tale of two halves huh I mean it was I mean that first the way that first half went I was like all right this is gonna be this is probably gonna be like that last game we had you know come down to the down to the wire in the fourth quarter but um, yeah the Chiefs just kind of they kind of came out flat in that second half but yeah, leave me your thoughts in the comments bo below um, on this game. You right? How'd you think we did? And uh, yeah, get us, give me your overall thoughts. But and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. <coughs> but if this is your first time to the channel, tap the subscribe button and the bell next to it. Ding ding. 
That way you'll be notified when I upload new videos. So until next time, guys. Keep it retro.